Hello Libra and welcome to my channel Zen Within Me. Okay, today's reading is going to be a love reading for you, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising. But before we get into it, I just want to uh, make a couple of announcements. For Black Friday, one day only, 30% off my Teespring store and my Zen Within Me website. Those links are down below in the description box. I'm also doing a November reading giveaway, okay? So I'm giving away five three-card readings, and to participate, all you have to do is follow the instructions down below in the description box, okay? So, Libra, my darlings, let's get into it. Okay. Guides, guardians, ancestors, and angels, please give me clear and concise messages for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and what is going on in their love life at this time. Okay, what messages do you have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding their love life at this time, please? Please continue to protect us, watch over us, and guide us always. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, what's going on, Libra? What does Libra need to know regarding their love life at this time, please? Last shuffle. What messages do we have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding their love life at this time? All right, sometimes just one comes through and that's okay. So let's see what this one card is. Ready? Drum roll. <laughs> okay, Six of Pentacles. Okay, so someone's sharing, showing gratitude. Okay, this is a successful material gains. It could be um, gifts coming in, money received. Okay, that's not so bad. Someone's spoiling you. Okay. Well, the holidays are coming, so maybe it's going to be a really nice Christmas gift. Let's see. What other messages do we have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding their love life at this time? Do we have protection? Okay. This person is watching over you. They're protecting you. It could be um, supporting you. And I don't mean that in like you can't take care of yourself. I'm just saying they support you in everything that you do. They protect you. They make sure that you're taken care of here with the six of pentacles. You know, they make sure that you don't, you, you don't want for anything. You know what I mean? That you, you're watched over. You're protected. They take care of you. As long as you let them, they'll do it. So I'm feeling a lot of love here. Okay, last shuffle. Any other messages from the crystals for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding their love life at this time? No, okay. Yeah, so this person, this person really looks out for you that you're involved with. Who doesn't want that, right? That's beautiful. Getting, they want to shield you from all like negativity and crap. They want to give you a good life. Okay, so what messages do we have for Libra regarding your love life from the archangels and the animals? Okay, so these are the archangels and your spirit animals coming through. So far we have Rabbit, Recognize Your Significance, Archangel Gabriel. And you may also be dealing with a person named Gabriel, okay? And Rabbit could even be a nickname. So there's just so many ways that the messages come through. Like, you guys just have to really see how does this resonate with me, okay? It could just simply be the spirit animal. Look it up for more details. And uh, also look up Archangel Gabriel. But it says, recognize your significance. So I'm feeling for some of you, you may, um, how can I put it? You may, because um, I know a lot of people that do this. 
may like this person could be like, oh, let me do this for you. Let me do that for you. Let me buy you this. Let me buy you that, you know, and it could just be simple things, you know, and you're like, no, no, it's okay. I'm good. I could do it myself. You know, you need to recognize your significance. It's okay to, you know, have somebody take care of you. It doesn't mean that you can't do it yourself. Also, law of attraction, whatever you put out, you get back. So if somebody is trying to be kind to you and generous and you keep, no, no, it's okay, it's okay. The universe is hearing, okay, you don't want someone to be kind and generous to you and they will stop that and then you won't get it anymore. So just, oh, yes, thank you. That's so kind of you. I appreciate that. Accept it. Recognize your significance. You deserve it. It's okay. It doesn't make you less of a person or, or less... Um, what's the right word, less um, independent in any way. It's just allowing this love and, uh, you know, caring to come in. Dolphin, live joyfully in the present. Archangel Jolet, yeah, enjoy this. You know, don't worry about the past, the present, uh, the future, excuse me. Just enjoy what's happening now, okay? And Swan, demonstrate grace and majesty. Archangel Bokpi. So just, you know, be appreciative, be kind, treat people the way you want to be treated. So if this person's being nice and kind and generous to you, accept it and just do it in return. Any other messages for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding their love reading at this time? Okay, last shuffle. Any other messages for Libra? Thank you. Okay, so now we're going to go to the Moonology cards. What other messages do we have for Libra? Sun, Moon, Rising. Regarding their love life at this time. What other messages do we have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding your love life at this time? Okay, last shuffle. Any other messages for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding your love life at this time? Okay, just the one. That's fine. Thank you. Have faith in your dreams. Waxing crescent moon. Okay. Have faith in your dreams. Okay, now let's get some letters here for you. Any initials or relevant letters here for Libra at this time regarding their love life. Okay, P. Paulson is coming through. It could also be Paul. And then also P for protection. So this person really wants to take care of you. Could be you to them also. Like it's very important to them that you're you're taken care of and vice versa are. Okay, this person can also be um, from Puerto Rico or Puerto Rican. I'm getting Ricardo. You. Okay, so I'm seeing purr. P-U-R. Like a cat purr. So this person, either you or they, you make each other very comfortable that like you cuddle and I'm not going to say you purr like a cat. Some of you may for whatever it is you're doing, that's your business. You may have a cat that you share together and that's why purr is coming out. Um, they may gift you a cat. So where I said like, oh, they may buy you a gift or something like that. This is gift to receive. They may buy you a kitten or adopt a kitten. Um... It could also be like P.U.R., that pure water. Maybe you'll get 
one of those for the fridge um, as a gift if they know that you like to have your um, clean water. Okay, we have O. I'm also seeing run, like this person wants to run to you. Like they, they just really care about you and you to them, however it resonates. Also, pour is being spelled out here, P-O-U-R. So someone may be pouring someone something. It could be the water, it could be, you know, wine, rum I'm also getting. Again, however this resonates with you, okay? I suggest that um, in every single reading where you see these initial cards, you write the letters down and just meditate on your own to see what messages your guides pull for you specifically. Okay. Yeah, that's enough. Okay, so we have G. So now I'm also seeing the word group spelled out. So however group relays to you, you may go out in a group. For drinks, why? There may be some kind of celebration this person. I don't know. I got through before. Somebody may be getting, like, giving a gift. The holidays are here. They, they may be giving you, um, like, a ring or something like that. They may just give you the gift when it's you're around a group of people. It could be the holidays, like Thanksgiving, Christmas Eve, New Year's Eve even. Okay. And then I'm seeing your, like they're saying they're yours or you are theirs, you know, like you're mine, yours, I'm yours, but not in a possessive way, just like they care so much for you that you have their heart. Okay. I'm also seeing gym. Someone may go to the gym. So I see guy. So if you're, if they're a lady, you could be like, yeah, this guy, you may refer to him to your friends and say, this guy, you know, okay. And then we have S. I'm also seeing spy. Someone may be spying on someone. But I don't see it as like malicious spying. It's just like if someone's you're together and your phone goes off, you know, they might just walk by and just like look to see who the notification is from. Not that they're going to go in your phone and like, you know, invade your privacy, but they just may like, you know, innocently spy here and there, you know, just because they do care for you so much and they feel that you're theirs, you know. That, you know, they just may get uh, a little defensive sometimes and, and they feel the need to just, you know, protect themselves and protect the relationship to make sure that, okay, you're not talking to somebody else or vice versa, you know. I'm also seeing hours. So, again, here, hours goes with sharing, you know. They, they see that everything you guys have, it's, it's shared, it's ours, okay? So I may even say it's ours or yours because I don't see like mine here or anything like that. Like I'm yours, everything I have is yours, you know, it's all ours. I'm also seeing sour grape. So someone may like to, to eat like the sour grape candies or something like that, so that might be another sign about your person to determine like, yeah, that's who we're talking about here. Okay. Okay, so that's all I have for you, Libra. Thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing, and watching, of course. Peace and love. I will see you in the next reading.